All right, guys. Uh, today I'm just going to be showing you a couple of things that uh, come with the clutch kit and occasionally what we need um, to actually verify the correct clutch for your vehicle. So uh, we've got a Sierra clutch here um, off a 94 SJ70. So there's two variances in the um, clutches for the Suzuki Sierra. So their variance in that um, in their clutches is in the teeth. So it is a little bit of annoying, but to actually make sure you do get the correct kit, you're gonna to have to remove your gearbox, get into the clutch and either count the, the gearbox main shaft or the clutch plate itself. So what I want to do is just grab a white pen, mark one of them, and count to the right as your first one and then include the paint or do count the painted one to five and just don't count that so this one here i've already counted it previously we know it's a 20 tooth uh clutch kit that we need for this one so it's always good to get in there measure it make sure you know what you what you need before you get there um, another one that we do need sometimes is the clutch plate measurement so this is your clutch plate and then you've got your pressure plate. So the clutch plate across two points, across the straight, and this one's 190. So a couple of variances on some of the Hiluxes, you'll find it's like 230 or 215 or 190. So if we ever ask those sort of questions, that's what you need to be measuring is here, this clutch plate itself. So I'll show you what comes in a new power drive clutch kit. So as you can see in this old one, it's pretty worn out, it's nice and old. It's got some hot spots in the actual pressure plate itself, so you can't actually machine these hot spots out. And once you do have sort of a hot spot on there, it's always going to have that little bit of a shutter. Um, and you can hear this is rattling. All these springs here have lost their tension in the actual clutch plate itself. So, you know, the power drive clutch kits, brand new clutch kit. So, in the kits, you'll find your thrust bearing or thrust bearing, your spigot bearing or spigot bush depending on what type of vehicle it is. So some ve vehicles have a brass spindle bush, some of them have a bearing style one. So whatever the car requires will be in the kit. Um, a set of instructions um, prior to inst installing and stuff like that. One, The number one thing to always do, always get your flywheel machined before replacing your clutch. So in here also you'll find your clutch plate and also a brand new pressure plate so great kits um, you'll find all these kits available at onlineautoparts.com.au